Poor girl. Looks like head trauma. I don't like it. One second you're setting up for a party. Next second, lights out. We have to call CSI. This may take a while. Whoa there, kid. This is a close crime scene. Put a hold on that, officers. Let me take a crack at this one. Where are the suspects now? I didn't do it, you know. I couldn't have. What? Whatever Chad told you is bullcrap. I didn't kill her. I did not. Look, why don't you just start from the beginning? <sighs> Fine. We were setting up in the LGI for our annual lock-in. Here's the ladder, guys. I gotta go to the library to get a new book. Be back in a gif. Fiddlesticks. Creepers, creepers, you killed her! That's what I found on the floor. Ah! Bruh. The creeper was covered in blood, so it's pretty obvious that he was to blame. Plus, I wasn't even, I wasn't even in the room at the time, so it couldn't have been me. Thank you for your time. What's up? You seem awfully nonchalant about all of this. Can you tell me what happened? Yeah, whatever. It was no big deal, really. We were just setting up for a lock-in, and... Well, looks like y'all have this under control. I'm gonna head down to the weight room and blast my packs. Around my packs. Jeepers, creepers, you killed her. Bruh. Yeah, I managed to keep my cool even though it was pretty wild. But yeah, it was obvious that that creeper Norman did it. He had blood on his shirt and everything. Thank you. So I heard you were at the scene of the crime. Care to tell me what happened? We were setting up for our lock-in. I was listening to music. That's when I got my nosebleed. No. When I got back to the LGI, I found her. That's when I called 911. Interesting. Thank you for your cooperation. Anything else you need to tell me? I don't know. I mean, they're all good kids. They had good grades, especially the jock. Really? Let me see his file. 
Interesting. He only has good grades recently. Until last semester, he was failing everything except football. Oh yeah, we went through her phone. All we found was a picture taken a few moments before the time of death. Wait a minute. What, what is, is it? it? Listen up. The four of them were setting up in the LGI for their lock-in. Everything seems normal until the nerd walks in with that impossibly heavy ladder. How does he carry it? The jock shouldn't be here at all. You have to be passing all of your classes to attend the lock-in, and everyone knows his head is emptier than a basketball. How did he have the grades to attend? Bro, my packs. That creepy guy got a nosebleed, but that's not a surprise. I had English class with him last year, and it happened at least once a week. <sighs> he couldn't have been in the room when the victim was killed. He was in the bathroom cleaning up. That brings us to the victim, and who had a reason to kill her. Good-natured as she was, she ran out into the hallway to help the creepy guy with the nosebleed. On our way back into the LGI, she stops for a quick selfie, but unbeknownst to her, she captured something that nobody was supposed to see. Ooh, this is some good lighting. Yo, it's not what it looks like. It's okay, I didn't see anything. How much did you see? I'm talking to you! How much did you see? Nice work, detective. 